Good morning, friends. Well, I have guests in town. <laughs> Actually, I have guests in the house. And uh, we'll be doing some touristy things this week. And of course, I'll be taking you along. I think we're going to go to the uh, Round Pyramids northwest of here, the Guachamotones. Uh, they want to go out to Mascala Island, where the old prison is, and um, probably going to Guadalajara, the zoo, uh, that'll be a day, um, the Libertad, uh, big market at Juan de Deos. Anyway, going to be touristing this week, which will be unusual on my channel, usually it's just about me hanging around, but. Come on, let's go. Please enjoy my stories or whatever else might be on my mind today. Well, no tourist comes to Ahihik without going to the Tiangas. And what I do is I drop them off at the top. It's about a two block walk downhill. And then I drive around and park at the bottom. Then I walk up from the van to meet them. And that's what's going on. This is the the Tiangas on Wednesdays in Ajijic, Jalisco, Mexico. The Tiangas um, move around. So it's uh, Wednesdays in Ajijic and Thursdays in Hoco, Mondays in Chapala. And some of it is the same that moves around uh, for the daily um, Tiangas in each city. The one in Chapala is a lot bigger. The one in Hoko is sometimes a lot less um, expensive. So I'm going to meet my nephew. His name is Patrick and his wife Heather and their eight-year-old son George, whom we're going to call Jorge while he's here in Mexico. Oh, here, I found some tourists. What did you I get? did. What'd you get there? The coconut. The coconut. I got a little, I'm a white guy walking around here. I might as well look like a tourist I really am. <laughs> very fun for me to have guests in town because it gets me out of the house <laughs> and it encourages me to go and do things that uh, I don't normally do because I've been here so long. It's like uh, you live in a place and you get used to just doing what you do. I lived in Portland, Oregon for 27 years, never went to the Japanese garden for instance. So. Probably going to be doing some more of this stuff. They've got a whole list of things they want to do that we'll be uh, going to see in the next few days. And of course, I'll have my camera. Look at the size of the cloud forming over there. We might get a real thunder bumper tonight. Guess what mode of transportation we're on now? We just left the town of Mazcala. This is the Malcolm de Mascala. And we're heading for a presidio. It's an island with an old prison that was used back in the revolution. This is our guide for today, Ruben. Wow. I don't know if you watch my videos, you know I'm a fan of trees and 
Man, this is one of my new favorites. Wow. Oh, and then over behind me, there was this one. What a canopy. Reuben is parking the boat. There was some concern about him backing out and going away, but then we figured out we haven't paid him yet. We'll be okay. The island have a lot of story. The first story we know because we know because we find a lot of pieces. What kind of pieces? Okay, the pieces they wanna the Indians build them or use them, you mm -hmm. know, like uh, toys or you know, uh, a lot of Indian species we find them. Pottery? A lot. Yeah. Okay, we put it in the museum, in the museum. Yeah. But the people in the museum sell them to people uh, say, see. you know, because it's expensive pieces. Yeah. I mean, each piece like this big cost, you know, I mean, uh, 10,000 pesos. We, we're talking about five, $500. Right. I mean, it's expensive for, for one piece. Mm -hmm. So anyway, we find them a lot. This is the, we know the Indians living here for years, years and years. Oh, hundreds of years. Yes. Yeah. There's one uh, ceremonial center on top, so mm -hmm. I'm showing you. Okay. Okay, the second one, uh, Revolution Time. Okay. This the is 18, 1812? The Revolution Time uh, in Mexico, yeah. Mexico City, start 1810. Uh -huh. So the peoples in the island, the story say a thousand peoples come to the island from uh, all, uh, all around the lake, from uh, Chapala Lake. So the peoples come together to the island and stay here for and start eight, 1812 to 1870. They come here to be safe from the revolution? Yes, from okay. the revolution. Okay, when uh, when we explain the story, we tell it to the persons. Uh, there's three canyons, or canyon. Mm -hmm. uh, what is the, 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 yeah, it's a canyon. Canyon? Cannon. Yes. A, a big gun. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yes. So we 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 explain the the person you know mm -hmm. the street and the island. Ah, no. He, I mean, the person's thinking we are liars. Yeah. Okay. Why? Because in that time we talking about two hundred and something years. So how those Kenyans come to the island? You know. Okay. The story say three big boats come uh -huh. from the ocean. Uh huh. Uh, the government bring them to uh to the to to the to Chapala Lake. Right there is a Tlachichilco del Carmen. Mm -hmm. There's one like a, like a muela where, where the, the government put those boats in the water. So those, you know, the, the, the government drive into the island when the thousand people stay here and start shooting them. Is there any record or knowledge about the level of the lake at that time? Because wow. when I came here 20 years ago, you could drive a half a mile from the yes. pier in Chapala to Look, the water. In that time, well, I think it's like 20, 25, 30 years ago. Yeah. Okay. In that time, you can walk in from this island to the other island. Cause yeah. it's, 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 uh, there's right. no, no water in the middle. And, uh, okay. In that time, that's why I'm asking you, the people's thinking we are liar, but in that time we find them a lot of uh, a canyon balls. Yeah, okay? canyon balls. Yes, here but, on the island. Yeah, yeah. And uh, okay, there's two kinds or two different canyon balls. Uh -huh. Okay, the the originals the government used them as a metal balls. Okay, right. It's like this big. Yeah. Okay, but there's no many in here to those people use them. Uh, those canyon balls, he used them, but they don't have any enough, you know, to, to use those canyons, because it's three in the island. I'm showing you where is one, one okay. and, and the other one and the other one. Okay. So the story say the, the, the Indians with the, the Spanish peoples, um, do the girl in, a, in 1812. So build the, the canyon balls, but with rocks. Ah. Uh. In a, so it's made out of stone. Yes, and that's true because yeah, I'm sure. getting I'm getting on my hand. And uh, when uh, when it's, when when yeah. the water goes really low. Yeah. So the second one, eighteen eighteen eight um, eighteen twelve, start the revolution time, 
and finished about 1816-1817. Okay, the, the, the government set him in, in Jalisco by 1817. So the government from Jalisco uh, speak with the peoples in the island and, and he's he doing like a trade, you know, give me the island and I'll give you loan and see around the lane, oh. okay? And the people say, okay, that's fine. Give me, okay, and he changed him. And uh, so the government from Jalisco do the prison, prison, mm -hmm. and here. That's why the name, the name for the island is Isla del Presidio de Mezcala. Mm -hmm. Isla des Island. Presidio is prison. And uh, Mezcala, this uh, the town, okay? Eight, and uh, and, and uh, what kind of people, you know, the government bring it in here? The bad, bad people from Jalisco, Michoacán, and Guanajuato. So how many? The story say 300, three to 400 in, uh, in the prison all the way over there. Okay, why he closed him by 1857? Because inside, there's no rooms, no beds, no nothing. Nothing. Just a corral. It's just, it's just a corral and just a, <laughs> like a, like cigarettes in size. Yeah. So it's bad, bad. That's why the government, you know, thinking to close them. And, and well, let's go them. see some of it. Okay, yeah. let's go. Now they actually call these trees white blanco, which is <laughs> redundant. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and it's nice because they don't need much dirt. I mean, in that one, you know, wow. growing just in the rocks. So uh, this is my nephew and his wife and uh, oh, son. See the sign in there? The first construction Teneria. on the island? It's Tenerife. Yeah? What is Tenerife? Water. What is what? Tenerife. Tenerife? A cannery? Yes. They make food and put it in a container? No, no, no tan. Oh, tan, like cowhide. I mean, leather, leather. The ladies, the, the, the Indian ladies. Yeah. 250 years ago, uh, she needs to do that because yeah. they don't they don't have any stores to buy you know the clothes. Right. Okay. The Indians, 1812 to 1817, living in a, a Indians ladies in a, the lake. So he needs clothes for everybody. Let's go. One uh, Catholic church. So this is uh this is the capilla. 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 There's a church. Iglesia. Sí. Okay, 1812 to 18, 1817. So the story say there's one father in the island and this is a one church built in 1810 and used in 1812. Okay, and this is one a church. Okay, I'm, 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 I'm told you, I'm explaining to you what this, the roof is not original, okay? The, the roof, uh, the government put it in there to save the construction because the construction uh, started, you know, fell. If you see the wall right there, see? Uh -huh. Yes. That's really old, and you can see the new area. Okay. So the All right, yeah, up above. The columns, too. Old uh, wall, oh, the reconstructed the bricks, wall. The bottom, this original, new one, original, and new one. Oh, okay. in the then same way with this. The stone in there. Yeah, original. New ones and original. Mm -hmm. But the government, uh, 25 years ago, tried you know, to fix them and uh, to save it like a moose over here. So the original roof might have been no, part the original, wood. The original, wood? The original roof, the story say there's a branches, yeah. and like a concrete in the top, yeah. so you can walk in, in the top. Yeah, it's enough strong to walk in, but there's a branches, there's a, a nice strong branches, mm -hmm. but not like that concrete like that. Um, so know, this building is what? That one is a fork, Casa Fuerte. Casa Fuerte. A strong house. A strong so house. Th this is the, the really, really strong house because look, nobody can go in. And when the bridge goes up, <laughs> nobody can go out. Ah, there's a moat. Yeah, look. Ooh. So do you think they didn't? Do you think they fill it with water? No, sure, they, for sure, it's filled by water. The story say four hundred people. So he's telling us that. Okay, 
I say, well, I think it would be more difficult to, to get across the moat if there's no water. But he said, no, when it was full of water, all the walls were really slimy with mold. So people would slip. They couldn't get out if they got in the water. This is a bed for a people sleeping. Bread for, for, okay. for prisoners? No, 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 this is for soldiers. For soldiers. Yes. No, this is not a this is not a prison, okay? This is a fort. Casa fuerte. Uh, this is a fort. Town. This is not the prison. Okay. The wall, the, the, the wall, the wall is like a uh three feet wide, so that's why the cannonball don't cross the wall. Okay? So I'm finally understanding that this is not the prison. This was a strong house built to keep people out, not to keep people in, during the revolution when the thousand people on the island were trying to avoid the revolution. And these are the walls that are three foot thick to keep the cannonballs from coming in. And the moat was to keep people out, not to keep people in. And the thousand people, uh, the wealthy people lived in here, and all of the poor people who serviced them lived outside the wall. All starting to make sense. Okay. This is a nice, beautiful area where you can see where the government do the reconstruction. But this is so this is this is so original. Mm -hmm. And this is the reconstruction. Okay. Right. In this room, I can tell you the floor, there's a beautiful floor. Yes. Two hundred and something years. This is for a rich person floor. Okay. okay? And this one, this shells. Mm -hmm. Okay, for that guy. Look the other one inside. Is this in the store? This, this is a, a sleeping room. Another uh, second room? No. That one. And this one is this one is one sleeping room. Look. The point he's making is that this design at the top indicates that it was a wealthy person who slept in this room. This will be the kitchen. Yes. And this one, that's for cooking, okay? This is, this is a reconstruction. And this is, neat, this is really, really old one. Mm -hmm. it's, this, is, this is original, okay? The bricks and everything. The stove top and the fire is underneath. Yeah. Yes. So you can put the wood right there. This is a eating area right here. And this is for tortillas. Okay? The ladies hit me here in tortillas. Area. See? So it's the dining hall. It's for sleeping. Look. This is a bed in a bed right here. So they sleeping they sleeping this way? Yes. Because people were shorter. Yeah. 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 Is that a bad player? Huh? Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we're going up to where the This is beautiful. Where the guards okay. would go, huh? Okay. This is a nice, beautiful view. Ooh. Okay. Over here, when I'm kid like him, I'm see. There's a one uh, lighthouse in here. Yeah, okay. But the government move him over there because they're too heavy. Right. And uh, the construction goes down mm -hmm. know, when uh, when the government fixed it everything so he moved the lighthouse over there and that one worked okay night. so we need the lighthouse because when you drive it in the night so the light flashing so when the light flashing uh when uh, we know to drive one boat uh we know it's in mezcala chapala what color is it que color that one is red one. In the uh, Alacrans? Verde. Ah, see. Sí. See. Sí. So you know, yeah, good idea. See. Sí. Are there more ashore? Yeah. Look. 
25 years ago, the government fixed the floor. Yeah. Fixed the uh, the roof. The, the wall is original. You can see in there. What? See? What? Yeah. What are those uh, reservoirs for? Water? No. Those? Okay. Because the, the, the cement, the yeah. one, uh, the one, uh, the one the government using in, in the island. Uh huh. So we call them a uh, cemento vivo. Ah, okay. Cement life. Right. Okay. Or, or cal viva. See. Sí. Okay. In that material, he needs to uh, mix it in, in those holes. Because this is, is this one. Uh, you need to put a mask. Right. In, uh, in, uh, what is the name? Glasses. Yeah, it's because it's cal. Yes. Yeah, I understand. It's uh, natural. Right. Yes, and that's why uh, he do he do those to mix them. That that one over there is the the, the little island. So okay, seventy years ago. Yeah. Seventy, eighty years ago. The story say, uh, well, no, it's not a story because my dad, uh, he speak my, he speaking when when he's speaking, uh, he, he asked me, but. But that island right there, so 70, 75 years ago, uh, we low with the water level almost five meters, four to five meters. Mm -hmm. So when the water goes up about two, two, two and a half meters, yeah, goes all the way. So 75 years ago, the water goes almost cover the there's, whole island. There, there's no island. Yes. Yeah, I saw pictures in Chapala. The yeah. water is up to the, the Casa Brana. See, si. yeah, to the church, to, to the Casadores uh, restaurant. Do so, you? You say you own part of that? You are from dad, your father? Yes, my dad. Yeah, that one. Uh, my family stay there. My uncles, yeah. my uncles, and my dad. And uh, my dad, he had one a little piece alone uh -huh. on the other side. And uh. But there is just rocks in there. So Ruben, see you, you Mascara <laughs> royalty. Huh? Well, yeah. <laughs> but I'm not a rich man. <laughs> hey, you're not a rich. It's not everybody could say that's my island. <laughs> oh, so there's a wall down there that was part of the prison? You see? You can... You yeah, can I see. The yeah. round wall over there? Yeah. That yeah. one is. And what's this building? Okay, that one when uh when the prison people didn't want to work, yeah, you know he put it inside in oh. here element there. Oh, casa so de castigo. Okay. Really? Okay. Uh, yeah, it's true. Hmm. You can see in the wall. Yeah. You know, it's one bowl right yeah. there. Yeah. Okay, one uh, piece of wood crossing all the construction. Yeah. So when he, uh, there's uh, like two ropes in there, they hang them. Yes. And that one, that's why that construction is close to the, uh, he's closing for, nobody can go in. You can see, you can see the door closed. And that construction right there. Okay, and mention, because the cemetery, is really close with what the captain says. Mm -hmm. The cemetery for the island. So the Indians that uh, worked and did the service jobs, they all lived out in these pe yes. places when there were a thousand people living on this island. Yeah, and uh, 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 we call them in all this area, uh, and the, the patio, the piedra. Yeah. But there's a one big patio. There's yeah. a lot of weeds right now, but you can see the rock. Right. And there's a big patio right there, a, a rock patio. Yeah. Uh, and the people that live back here in the fort, yes. are the Spanish rich people. Yes. Gotcha. For sure. So when the prison was going, they used this building that we're in. Yeah. Uh, for the offices. For the offices and the yes. prison workers. Yes. Not the prisoners. Got it. Yes. Ooh, it started. This is good. Oh, good day. We're going to go around the other side of the island go see the prison. Good tour, Ruben. Thank you so much, sir. Bob. Thank we you. Yeah, we're going to go around. Cormorants. Yeah. Ques this is a farm fish. What is yeah. K? How do you okay. say? How do you say cormorant in Spanish? 
We, we know those ba batorrialas. Those? Do those kind of birds? Yeah. Uh, they dive in the water. Yeah, but they, go, eat, they, go, they go eat the fish? Yes, a lot. He like to, to and th those goes in the water yeah. and stay in the water for a long time. I know. Uh, so it's catfish in there? No, now. We put in fish like two or three years ago. Yeah. But the people still, you know, the fish. People thing. come and steal the fish. See. Yeah. And it's a, and we broke. So we broke. So no more aqua farming here. No, cause uh, we broke. You're broke. Yes. What would you do if you had money? Catfish for each. A catfish. Yeah. Cost five or six pesos. Yeah. If you buy one thousand, we we call them back. Yeah. Uh, Sixty thousand pesos. The suspense. Yeah. And, uh, okay. It's nice because when uh, when you growing those fishes, uh, yeah, one pound. Yeah. I mean, you get a lot of money. But to growing, you need to give us a food. The food is expensive too. You need to buy like a uh, one ton. Yeah. So one ton cost twenty five thousand pesos. Okay, everything is fine. But when a guy come and they start to steal, you know, the, yeah, the fish, there's yeah. a big problem. Oh. Sure. And uh, when, uh, when the prison people, he knows when it's a day or when it's a night, yeah. you can see the wall, you can see the holes in the wall. Yeah. See the wall, wall? Yeah. And uh, that's why when uh, he knows when it's a day or when it's a night. Look, and there's no, 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 no restrooms inside. Just one big room with 300 people, no restrooms, no beds, no light, except for those little holes. Wow. I think they closed the prison in 1957 because the state of Jalisco decided it was cruel and unusual punishment. So all the deckhands are ready. Where are you? Good morning, Stardust. <laughs> so we're having some trolleys for an appetizer. Mm -hmm. Did you get enough lime on this one right here? I have no idea. Put some of that stuff on it too. Hell yeah. There. Okay. <laughs> Wow, it's not it's not nearly as bad as sardines. <laughs> what we have here is catfish caviar. Yeah. Should I take a picture of your face while you're doing that? I don't, I don't know. The catfish caviar. Mm -hmm. It's really good, you say? Mm hmm Okay. I had seconds. Yeah. So absolutely, that guy. Catfish caviar. That's the best way I can describe it. I think he's waiting for another one. That's good. That's really good. Doesn't taste like fish at all. You've had real caviar. Doesn't taste like caviar either. Hmm. It's like chicken with the consistency of polenta. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, so I did shirales and I did catfish caviar. And now... I'm going to have a Mexican classic, a hamburger and fries. I have forgotten lately, I used to always try to get some dog content in all my videos. So here we go. I'm over here to take a picture of the clouds. I'm really impressed with the cloud bank. Well, we had a good lunch over there. Time to head back towards Ahiik. Hey, if you like me, give me one of those thumbs up. And please subscribe and hit that little bell so you know when I post next. 
Please share me with your friends on social media. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed what was on my mind today.